Fire destroyed everything here at this barn in Shelby County. What's left? Just the wreckage from last night. Tens of thousands of dollars worth of property and 10 show ponies are gone. Just looking at it right now, what, what, are, you, what are you thinking? That ain't going to be a lot of work. With debris still smoking, 84-year-old R.C. Shelburne describes how his barn on Ash Avenue used to look. I had a feed room right here and a washroom right there for to wash them. The barn and everything in it, now just a pile of metal. I had 10 horses on this side right here. Shelburne says just before one Tuesday morning, a storm rolled through this area. I heard a big, uh, big noise like lightning clapping and uh, it woke me up. Shortly after the lightning and thunder, he heard something else. And I heard the cracking and popping and I looked out the window and it looked just like a, a yellowish light, you know, shining. I run downstairs and run out on the deck and look it was far from one end of it to the other. Shelburne called 911. Several fire departments were there within minutes, but it was too late. Usually barns have a lot of hay and and supplies in it, so usually once the hay catches on fire, it spreads pretty quickly. And the flames are shooting in the air, about look like 50, 100 feet high, and it's already beginning to fall in. It took about 25 firefighters two hours to put the fire out. In addition to the 10 ponies that were killed, Shelburne lost a lot of property. 16 foot flatbed trailer, you know four-wheel wagon. Also gone, expensive farm tools and machinery. Couldn't get in to get anything out of there. It was far from everything and the whole thing was on fire. The owner of the barn says his next course of action is to clean up, but with the amount of damage that's been done, he knows that'll take some time. Reporting from Shelby County, Tim Elliott, WLKY News.